Bienvenidos al Mundial de Rusia 2018. Es hora de empezar el juego a patear el balón. YouTube, what's up? Welcome back to the shop. So, today we have a special project in line for you guys. In honor of the World Cup that's coming up this Thursday, we are going to make a football ring. When I say football, I mean soccer, because I'm thinking in Spanish. So we're gonna make a soccer ring. So, check out some of these materials we're gonna use. So as you can see, we're gonna start off with a white ceramic base. We're gonna add a little bit of grass. Not that kind of grass, if that's what you were thinking. And then we have this soccer ball here, pretty kind of used and beat up, but we are going to see how we can incorporate this soccer ball into a ring with the grass and the base. All right, guys, so the first step in making this ring we decided to cut one of the panels out of the soccer ball and then peel it away from the ball. So we found one of the panels that had a lot of the blue and white lines to give some cool contrasts. Uh, a little tough to peel it away, but once we did, once we got that initial peel away, we were able to pull it off completely and we were left with uh, one panel. And then from there, we're going to take it and measure the inside channel of the ring and cut it into a thin strip that will fit right into that channel nice and tight. So as you can see, we're measuring and cutting. And then we wanted it to wrap halfway around the ring, so we measured the exact length and cut it so it wrapped just halfway around the ring and left the other half so we could inlay the grass into there. And then we use a CA glue to adhere the ring and the football, the football panel, and we get it nice and tight, nice down in the channel so it's well glued in. And then with the grass, we wanted to incorporate it in a way that would make it look natural instead of just laying it in there. So we stacked the grass up uh, straight like you would see in a, on a soccer field. Uh, and so we did that one piece by piece until we filled that other half of the channel. And then what we're gonna do is come by and just like a lawnmower, cut away all that excess. Kind of looks kind of cool. It's like a green afro on top of the ring. It's kind of a, <laughs> a funny, funny part of this, this process. And so after the glue cured, we were able to cut away the excess, uh, fill in any little voids that we might have missed, make sure that nice and dense with the, with the grass. And then what we did is we came by and we uh, put glue all around all the, any, all the extra voids that were left, seal the ring, make sure it's nice and watertight. And then we took our Dremel with a sanding wheel and cleaned off all the excess and get it ready so that we can throw it on the lathe and shave down any of the excess resin or glue that might have been left and fill in any voids. So there we have it, ready to put on the lathe. So on our lathe, we have different size chucks for different rings and different size mandrels. So we threw it on the, the mandrel and you can see we're taking this lathe bit and we're just taking off the excess resin, filling any any voids or any cracks that might be in the, gr in, in the glue. Just getting it nice and tight and water, water sealed, ready to polish it. So the next step is to take it through some different grits of sandpaper. So we started at a 320 grit and then we move our way up all the way to a 12,000 grit, super fine. And you can see we're squirting it with water just to make sure that the glue doesn't overheat because if you get it too hot it can negatively affect the finish and it can even peel away from the ring. And then once we get it all the way up to the polish we need, we use a micro polishing finish for plastic. And there you can see, we have our ring nice and shiny, nice and clean, very professional looking. 
So as you can see, the ring turned out really great. The combination of the soccer panel and the grass was just phenomenal. Really incorporates and takes into that feel of a, of a soccer field. Just a really fun ring to make. Cleaned up really nice. Really cool. Hey guys, thanks for joining us and watching as we made that ring. Honestly, it was a very unique ring. Um, very unique materials, honestly. Can't say we've ever used a soccer ball, if it'll focus. No, it's okay. A soccer ball and grass before in a ring, but turned out pretty cool. Kind of unique combination of colors and textures. Um, so if you haven't yet, please like this video, subscribe to our channel, because we are gonna be continuously pumping out new videos, trying new things. And if you have any suggestions for new videos, please comment below and tell us what kind of materials you want us to incorporate. Honestly, the options are limitless with the materials that there are in the world. So comment below your thoughts about the ring, comment below what kind of ring you want to see in the future from our shop. And also with the World Cup coming up this week, be sure to get your jersey on and root for your favorite team and go crazy. It's gonna be a good one. Thanks guys, see you next time, bye.